what's going on guys so today we're actually putting together a coolant tank that I make uh, it is uh, 5052 aluminum all laser cut from a local shop that I use to do my other oil tanks which I haven't made a video on but this will be a coolant tank and they actually can be made into oil tanks too we'll be doing that also be showing that but I'm gonna clean this up fit it up and weld it up and show you just a little bit about it so let's get to it I just turned on the welder sorry it's loud but these are what the tanks look like beforehand uh, it just comes laser cut eighth inch <clears throat> but I will show you guys bending one before this video ends but we're just gonna mock this up I got these plates I couldn't find my these these actually in, in the first place so found them finally and got this all mocked up looking good corner to corner so yeah fitment for no clamps and stuff just a uh, little sheet metal break so now I'm going to wipe the whole thing down I need one of those little bottles I know Index helps a lot with welding aluminum. Alright, let's try this out.
So I got this tank all welded up. I know I kind of skipped a lot, but I threw up a bunch of pictures and this is the final outcome for this one. So here I am, we're gonna be pressure testing it. It's just all like a paint valve, paint pressure valve, and then screwed in there and then air fitting so I can just hook it straight to the hose and then I'll let the air in there. You don't have to use much on this because it's pretty small. So let's just stick the cap on. Yeah, there's no air going in yet. <laughs> you could let her fly. So, I'm gonna get this pressure tested here. I'm just gonna start spraying it now. I'm just using some freaking simple green because I don't know where the soap is right now. <laughs> 